Hello, here is another game against Tuna on 5 handicap and reverse Komi, but this time uh, Black wasn't outplayed and instead he killed the lower right corner. Actually he could kill this corner all along uh, with the monkey jump, but he didn't rush. Let's see. Lots of tactical uh, things could have been different. So this is a typical handicap 5 start, both for white and black, white covers one side then black takes the large point in a symmetrical position then white immediately goes sun sun this i wouldn't really recommend in a five handicap game i'm a little bit reluctant to play uh, an early sun sun invasion in uh, higher handicap games in lower handicap three or two it's still okay or in even games very uh, popular move but in high handicap it already feels good for black so here black should think about the block at d3 because he already has the middle side extension. Then of course he can no b in order to take sente and then play another big point like uh, r6 or another middle side extension. Uh, black can also play the double hane, hane double hane and in this case black will keep the corner and also the wall that uh, it's created here at d4 has the middle side extension at k4. So this is nothing to complain for black so far, but black block on the other side. And this makes uh, k4 feel a little bit flat. So white comes under and now black has to switch to the left side. The extension on the left side is a little bit um, conservative. Black should go further away from the wall, d9 or d10. This way it connects better to the c14 corner. So playing like that leaves a bigger gap on the left side. So at some point white can come in with a shoulder hit or even some invasion point. Can be C11 or D11 and then the left side is not going to be so large anymore. <clears throat> but white plays an inside approach. Actually for white it's good to play R6 because there is more space on the right side. So if black simply defends calm, white has a lot of room to fix the base on the right. Now playing the inside, uh, black can kick, that's a very good decision, white goes up, black defends, and now white extends. This L3 extension it's a little bit uh, questionable, so normally white extends only one space jump, like this or like this, it doesn't go all the way to uh, too close to K4, but white can also play the slide at K2, this is a bit harder for black to block. But when white plays L3 and black blocks K3, this feels good for black and white is still over concentrated. So it's very difficult for white not to become over concentrated here when black has the K4 in place. That's why one space jump even if it's a Korigatachi is the right move and then jump out. Now when black defends white will test the corner first and black usually will give up a few points just to keep most of the territory then white is fine on the outside. So with this move black blocks White has to go up or down, but either way it's painful. When white pushes out, black will honey in the head of two stones and even double honey. Now here, black has to, uh, white has to get ahead, black will connect, white jumps between the groups and black builds the territory on the right side. <clears throat> so white went down, then black covers here, that's fine. Uh, yeah, well white can push f3 first and then turn in sente and now play on the left side it's about time to do something to reduce the left side the shoulder hit like this or like this otherwise the left side moyo becomes too large so push first black gets ahead then white attacks on the right this is a very good point to to approach the right uh, corner now normally for white to uh, for black to to get rid of the sun sun invasion and the edge around r5 uh, black can play a double up move or just s5 now there is no more sun sun invasion this black can resist and kill it and when this happens uh, black's corner is safe white needs to extend for a base on the right then black can also protect the top right corner so the game still looks very good for black overall but everywhere uh, white made a base uh, the groups are safe too so black uh, played a pincer that's more aggressive then white invades the corner. <clears throat> now usually white can play r5, then extend back, or play Kosumi. 
And this is good enough to damage the right side. And go out into the center. <clears throat> now when this happens, uh, black play with fighting spirit, he went down. White plays a peep, very good. Black connects. But now, white should connect with a Kosumi. Because this way white keeps R8 connected too. So black can push here, white blocks, Atari connects. When this clamp is played, white answers, Atari connect. But white is connected to the outside R8. So in this case, white's corner will never die. Playing this move, black can separate. Now R8 is uh, separated from the corner and the corner is not completely alive either. Therefore, white missed the chance to play a flexible and uh, efficient move. This kind of Kosumi. Now, if uh, white pushes through, uh, sorry, black pushes through and then cuts, uh, white can capture a stone, leave in the corner, then black needs to play another move, and now white can also run out on the right. And if uh, white connects on the outside, black will capture the corner stone, but white can push through and separate Q6. So this is not so great for black actually. That's why black connects solid, but white should play S6. So it's good to remember S6 in this uh, local fight. Now black separates, very good. And here in order to keep I shape, uh, white should play T5. Black has to connect on the outside, otherwise white will cut. But then white still needs another move in the corner, uh, R2. If white doesn't play that move uh, and plays away, some big point, black will play S4, threatening to uh, destroy the eye. And when white covers, black will just go monkey jump, extend back, and when white goes down, this is only one eye. So it doesn't matter if white connects S5 or T5, white still needs to play another move in the corner in order to secure the eye shape. So white plays a solid move, and now it was supposed to play R2 or R1, just to make uh, 8 uh, squares in sight. When the shape is bigger than 6 in square, it's usually alive. So I didn't play this move. And black can just monkey jump and kill it right away. So if this happens, there's only room for one eye. Well, like this is the same thing. So white is brave, black turns, very good. Then block. This is a lot of pressure on white's bottom group. Black doesn't have to cut, black should hunt on top. If white cuts, then Atari and go down. So white has to extend and then black can surround everything. Now white still needs to play under to try to leave. And the group will survive because of the Sente forcing move around J1 that white could play. Uh, white can leave like this, but the corner will still die when uh, black plays the monkey jump. So black could play this S1 from the beginning. This cut gives white uh, eye space. Now Atari and white could actually take right away and the group is already alive. So on this move uh, white can block here. If uh, black removes the eye in the center uh, white can make twice like this. If uh, black plays on the bottom see here block take away the outside eye Hane block connect when black separates white makes the second eye. So white can leave with the bottom group now. Well it's still okay for black to surround everything because white has to go down here. <clears throat> and white should also play another move to leave in the lower right corner. So this is uh, a bit too conservative but for black actually it's already good because k6 is separated from the bottom and uh, white didn't really profit much in this fight. Jump cover so instead of this hane which is ultra proper uh black and kema in the corner i mean no gamer sorry the monkey jump and kill it so when white comes out here black can go between the groups and luckily there's nothing uh, white can do black will come out and white has more troubles on the side so white struggles to damage the center now but this snow is very heavy for white it's more interesting to play a shoulder hit on the left and then a one space jump and try to damage 
the center coming from the left side and also the direction of play is better because white can go towards uh, the stones in the top so just snobby then yeah defend the left side this is a good point makes a lot of territory for black on the left then white is trying to escape here black is just too conservative with these jumps but black feels good about his position actually black can push here once and descend in center everything is center on the left side so now the left side is safe and in the middle black should just uh, separate the groups this way and of course all the time monkey jump here and kill this comes very late uh, in the game so white tries to reduce more uh, that's a risky move in fact white now needs something in the center to keep everything connected this kind of uh, shoulder hit and nobi so when black pushes like this there's atari and a net this move can be separated with a jump but black is playing very safe now when white pushed here that's very risky black could just atari and then atari and capture everything so this was a bit submissive to block from the outside when it's possible to take the two stones if black goes here uh, sorry white approaches black will just capture therefore black defended super safe <clears throat> now some cut uh these maneuvers look to be desperate actually uh black can just surround everything from the outside like this if white pushes black can block if turn connect if this cut atari atari again and honey under now here black can block and those stones are uh, already losing the liberties and no way out so this creates some cutting points therefore white could go out mm -hmm. instead of atari black can block like this then atari and a hanging connection or a solid connection so the group is just heavy and must run out but we know uh, Tuno likes to play super thick mm, this is heavy why should play a Hane give up two stones Atari like this and Atari like this so in the end black played lots of moves to capture one and white managed to damage the left side that would be a flexible way to break that side like this white is still heavy Hane was good then white is still on the run so black got uh, separated on the left side but still builds a lot of territory it's better to go out with a push because he's threatening to go out at c12 and turn black will no be then came out like this so just run out and connect the top <clears throat> so far uh, black's groups are very solid and there is no way for white to catch up in in this handicap game and black can always play this move to kill so black played an invasion in the top but actually m17 it's a safer way to invade the top if white covers black simply pulls back and connects to the top also black and nobi first and when white blocks push atari connect and cover and this way black builds more now if white simply blocks on top black will pull back and connect to the top anyway so this would be a center invasion for black but black played a bit more desperate this 2k and it's also a little more dangerous so white can honey here and then connect solid and now the two stones they don't communicate to the top right anymore and they are also far away from the left so when black tries to connect he might die with everything inside this way uh, black can honey <clears throat> and then it's easier to make some shape bump is good too but instead of honey here where uh black it's already blocked black should play h17 this threatens to connect under or jump in the middle so when white covers black will connect to the top if uh, white plays on the top to make sure there is no connection underneath uh, black can jump out in the middle and then try to unstabilize the 
formation F15 from the other group and come out. Then think about the push and cut at L16. So with this Hane, white blocks, black is not completely alive here. But the cut doesn't work. Black can just play Atari and go down and capture the two stones. So the cut is too much. Uh, white can play H18. Black needs to block. White goes up. Black connects. And white plays the Kema. Like this, the group is surrounded and has only one eye. So when black plays here, white kills. <clears throat> this would be a good advantage psychologically to kill that invasion. But every time white cuts here, white should consider the Atari and push. And this way, black just uh, leaves big. So the cut doesn't work, but this move, it's threatening the cut. So when black connects here, white surrounds everything. If black tries to connect like this, white can push first and then block. Now when black comes out, white can push again. So there is no eye in the top. And in the middle, there are lots of white stones uh, waiting for black here. So even if black connects everything, you might die in the center with a larger dragon. So this was uh, white's big chance. Now... Uh, black can just leave by playing K19 because there is Mi between H19 and L18. Ari, come out. Uh, that's dangerous. Now white can Hane, then play L18. When black pushes, there's Atari and white can connect. So the group in the top died. Uh, no need to go for the two stones. Just kill the top with the Hane because those two stones in the center, even if they connect, they are still a target. So better kill the bigger group and what can be killed right away. White is going for these guys in the middle. Here it's better to connect like this because he's threatening to catch two stones on the left side. And then white hits center to kill the top. Okay, white it's uh, I mean black is going for a few stones in the center, not so big, because what happens in the middle with the cut uh, is going to kill more black stones. So this wedge is very good. Black is still on the run. Mm, that's not necessary. Those two stones are captured anyway, so white should honey in the top, then take the key point. Because in the middle, if black comes out, white will capture three stones. If black plays Atari, white captures like this. And then when black comes out, Atari, Atari again, and cut. So back to the original game. Uh, white protects here. Black secures the right. White is trying to cut two stones. That's not important. So again, white can kill the top with a honey. Now here on the right side, there's Atari on two stones. If black comes out, white turns and kills the other three. If Atari under, take these two stones, then black needs to play another move against the Han and push. So that was Ajikeshi. No, nothing in that uh, area. That can actually protect. Even if white goes Atari and connects, black can turn and kill the corner faster. Black has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 liberties, white has only 3. So this was uh, too conservative. But in the end, center for black. Now black leaves in the top. Uh, this is a minus, better play Hane. And like this, black only leaves with 2 points. This way, black just leaves bigger. 3 points and can damage in the top. Uh, desperate invasion, but it's difficult to live in that corner. Black kind of panicked. Shouldn't. Black can actually block on the third line to build one more point. If white cuts here, the capture works anyway. Normally just this. Or nothing. Anyway, if black cuts, white can capture. 
so why should leave in the corner <clears throat> now why to got instead of being center and black can kill now this is all forced and there is that in honey moves and no co so when white plays here black takes the vital point if white plays s5 uh, sorry s4 black can push t5 so yeah this was a good win by tuno but a little bit dangerous i mean the top could have died the lower right corner could escape and then on territory it's not so clear anymore if the top dies white has a lot of territory in the in that area and with the other territories in the middle and the bottom should be okay because black in the end has the right side and the left side i mean well most of the left side so overall this could have been a uh, white's game also if white just leaves in time in the lower right corner and kills the top then the game could be reversed better luck next time